We've been hearing about new advances in power steering technology, specifically electric power steering. To tell us more and how conventional power steering fits in, Nicole Devereaux is here in the AutoNet TV studios. Nicole? Thank you, Joel. Some very high-end cars have been featuring electric power steering for a few years now. An electric motor directly provides the power assist to making steering easier. There's no doubt we'll see much more of this as full electric cars and electric hybrids become more and more common. The vast majority of cars and trucks use a hydraulic power boost system. With hydraulics, fluid is pressurized by pump, which actuates a hydraulic cylinder to reduce steering effort. Some of these pumps are powered by an electric motor. Most pumps are powered by the serpentine belt, driven by the engine. Power steering fluid has the necessary hydraulic properties and the ability to lubricate the internal parts. The power steering fluid also protects components from rust and corrosion. Manufacturers recommend that the fluid be replaced on schedule. The old fluid is drained and the system cleaned thoroughly. Fresh fluid is then installed. Now, unfortunately, many people don't realize how important it is to service their power steering or even that it should be done at all. A neglected power steering system can develop leaks and the pump won't last as long. Now, signs that you may be having problems with your power steering include the need to constantly add power steering fluid, also a loud whining from the pump, erratic power assist, or high steering effort. If you're experiencing any of these problems, have your power steering checked out at your service center. Nicole, what about the mechanical parts of the steering system? What do you need to do for them? That's a great question, Joel. The rods, arms, joints, and knuckles that actually turn the wheels can become worn or damaged. A standard alignment service includes an inspection of steering components. If you notice any play in the steering wheel, that the steering wheel is off-center, or a noise coming from your front wheels, especially when you're turning, have your service advisor do an inspection so the problem can be corrected. Thank you, Nicole. For more safety-related videos, please visit autonettv.com. We'll be right back.